These fans on their feet in a frenzy, ready to celebrate. Rabotham will throw a fastball over the head of Johnson. He picks it back up. He fires. It's on its way. It's picked up by Jimmy Hall. Kent State fans have longed to hear it. Flashes, champions of the Mid-American Conference, back in the NCAA Tournament. From Water Street Tavern in downtown Kent, just near Acorn Alley, it is Selection Sunday. And for the first time in nine years, the Kent State Golden Flashes are about to learn their fate in the field of 68. Hi again, everybody. Ty Linder, Dave Carducci, Jacob Pavilak with you on a cold, blustery day here in Northeast Ohio, but nobody really minds all that much because inside of Water Street Tavern right now, the energy is completely palpable. It's through the roof. The Golden Flashes coaching staff, the players, they've all just been introduced to an adoring fan base. And this is a whole new crop of fans that has seemingly fallen in love with Kent State men's basketball all over again. That's all right. There's not a team that scores the ball easier than the Bruins, and Lonzo Ball has been the catalyst of it all. This is a good spot for the Bruins. I see them for half. I see them for They're about to be called. They will meet the 14th seed. Flashes are heading for the West Coast. And they will take on the Sons of Westwood on Friday in Sacramento at the brand new Golden Center.